Zitter's on the Winding Cove on the EDZ. He's currently selling the Future War Cult armor from Vanilla Destiny 2. It's pretty cool. Uh, it is the armor from Nessus. Just be aware of that. But there are differences with the with uh, shaders, as in some pieces are just unshaderable. So let's actually look at the armor set real quick. Uh, simulator gloves, you way too high mobility for me personally. Simulator robes is pretty nice. 19 recovery is always wanted. Two resilience though is pretty weak. Although you could probably put the 10 in discipline. So that way you can have a 10 recovery, a 17 discipline, and then a 17 intellect, which would be nice. And then you would just probably get a... Uh, another piece that has a lot more resilience because you definitely want resilience for the helmet way too high mobility and again way too high mobility for the warlocks unfortunate because you definitely don't want high mobility for anything but hunter and even then at this point i don't even know if you want that high mobility for hunter as well uh warlocks let me know if you guys are going to be picking this up as for the titans again this is the nessus set that you guys know and i personally again it's kind of it's unfortunate that we got the vanilla destiny 2 stuff because i would have loved to see like the season 2 stuff or even the season 3 stuff for my ogs i mean obviously i mean the curse of osiris stuff or the war mine stuff that would have been super dope but i mean this is the world we live in uh, for the armor pieces themselves, we're looking at a pretty high resilience. That's pretty nice. Everything else is pretty tragic, though. Uh, this is good, but at the same time, I I wouldn't pick this up. I mean, you could probably you could put a plus ten on the recovery, so that way 15, 19, 13, and a twelve in strength. It's fine, but I definitely have better pieces than this. A uh, helmet is actually decent, a 19 in resilience. You're probably going to want to bump the recovery up to a 19 as well. And then intellect the 22. This is pretty foul. I definitely would pick this one up. Uh, and this one's pretty mediocre. I mean, if you don't have something better, then I might as, you might as well pick it up. But I would probably skip out on this one. Titans, let me know if you guys are going to be picking any of these up again. I just wish we had more options. And last but not least, we have the Hunters, which, again, the Nessus set just with Future War Cult stuff. And at this point, some pieces are actually unshaderable, like the Future War Cult insignias. So, I mean, it's up to you, honestly. I would probably still pick it up, but I'm just I'm just be real with you guys. Like, just pick up the Nessus set. So for the armor itself, we're looking at 22 mobility. OK, OK, that's not terrible. Definitely not terrible. Uh. Recovery and resilience are a little too low, but I mean, you can bump up the resilience to a 17 and that's pretty fair, I guess. I don't know. Uh, 10, 10, 11 and 20. This is actually pretty good. One on pretty much everything that you want to see. And then you have the option to bump it up even more for one of them. I would probably bump up recovery. Maybe I might pick this up because a one on everything is pretty nice. Well, I mean, everything that you really care about aside from intellect or strength that's pretty nice uh helmet is mediocre definitely not picking that up and same thing for the boots so hunters let me know what you guys are going to be picking up as for weapons we're looking at seven serif v17 fourth times the charm and dragonfly do you have other perks on this nope i would ignore this one i close smg with the uh, dynamic sway and surrounded surrounded is getting a buff it is getting uh where is it this one it this is gonna be uh, a part of just regular surrounded which is nice but i'm not a fan of surrounded killing wind and wellspring i'm not mm, i'm gonna look at it just to see if it has another perk nope okay i'm gonna ignore that seventh serif cqc 12 this one could have been really good if it had okay so no oh and smooth bar. okay yeah i'm not a fan of this one either uh frectithist dual loader and thresh which also not a fan code duo with surplus frenzy i'm not even gonna look at that and nine hunger with zen moment and kill clip i would tell you to at least pick this one up kill clip is always nice on a, on a nine hunger but it sucks that it's zen moment although if you use controller then it's actually pretty good for you for exotics, we're looking at hawk moon with hip fire grip i'm ignoring that dead man's tail with fourth time to charm i I would recommend this one so fucking hard. The fact that you can just keep shooting this shit for almost forever, it seems, is such a dub that I this definitely picked this one up. Uh, we have Vigilant Swing with 
why am I saying with? There's nothing. It's Vigilant Swing. Here, that's pretty cool. Uh, Radiant Flux with 17 Resilience and Recovery at 12. I would actually pick this one up because you definitely don't want high res or high mobility for Radiant Flux. <laughs> you definitely don't want high um, mobility for Radiant Flux because you're not going to be using this all the time. So having more resilience and recovery is preferable because once you're using your super, you're, you're going to be using a lot of resilience and recovery. So that's probably the better choice here. Uh, Titans, you have Aeon safe with <sighs> it's the fact that like resilience and recovery, well, resilience is at eight, but recovery is at 18 as well. This is nice. Unfortunately, I would have loved to see that eight on literally anything else, but this is still good. I definitely would pick this one up and Luna factions with 13, 17, 16. Uh, I mean, it's okay. If you don't have a better one, definitely pick it up. Uh, let's actually see my luck this week. If it's not fucking terrible. Frosties. Okay. These might be good. These, uh, Ooh, yo. Okay. I'll pick that up. I definitely picked that up dog. Ooh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, sir. And or madam. Uh, yeah, fuck with this. Uh, two recovery is terrible, but I mean, I can fuck with it. Cause I, I'll just put something that's like at 40 recovery to even it out. So yeah, let me know what you guys are going to be. Uh, picking up in the comments below. I definitely would pick these up if you had the legendary shards to like waste and you wanted just more armor options. But again, just be aware that the Nessus set is literally this, this set. So I just want to like, I just want to make like, I just want to point it out because I don't want people picking this up and be like, well, I could have just picked up the Nessus set. It's like, yeah, I, I said you could just do that instead. So be safe and I'll see you guys later.